So this is a definitive guide nine for Final Fantasy IX. We're at the uh, Grand Citadel Southgate. A couple of treasures in here. Uh, just uh, there's one on the left in a minute, and you can't get the one up the ladder until much later. There's a card in there, an elixir card. So I'll come back and do that. Um, you just talk to everybody and be fairly nice to people, and get rid of this guy and that woman in the corner there. get a gate pass off one of the guards so we can go to get through all the gates now bit of a treasure bit of a moogle who's got a letter for us and uh, this gate's sort of on the right as you come out of Gizmo Loops Grotto there's a couple of items in here And then there's a blue magic creature by the coast. Um, it's a. Uh, oh, hang on a minute. Let's just get this chocograph. <laughs> so, this is an upgrade. Um, I think this is Peaceful Shore or something like that. Um, and we get the reef ability here. So, we can go to the sort of the light blue bits of the shoreline, which has got water in it. Reef, I guess, yeah. And this is the Chocobo's Dream world. Yeah, it's a little bit weird. So we've got our upgrade there. This is the nymph. Uh, you can learn Night from her. She basically puts everybody to sleep. I don't know how useful that is actually, because it puts uh, your team members to sleep as well. Um, so we're in Bermacia, there's a Stellatio coming up, just here, and there's magic vice, these things, that can give you magic hammer. There's also another creature uh, which does gradual petrify, so I made sure that all of my team were inflicted with that for the negative and positive uh, states effects trophy. There's a few... Um, mimics in here. You can avoid them quite easily but um, I, I killed them all because I, well that's what I wanted to do basically so. So there's two items in here. There's a dying guy there. Have a word with him and he tells you about a protection bell and there's a secret ether. shop as well with uh, maybe like one interesting item but yeah so you need to buy um, stuff off stilt skin every time you see him uh, for another achievement and also for another moonstone which is part of another achievement coupon up nice one I'll take that back to because my looks grotto when we get a chance and this is a timed battle. Now she's got three items, but I've only been able to ever get two. Uh, the Mithril Sword, I think, is the other one. But she gets bored and then she murders everybody.
can try the um, beer treats fight over and over because the continue starts just before it, but um, you've got very little time. And even with Bandit on, I couldn't get all three items. But you might get lucky and get the Miffle Sword first, it's a possibility. So I played cards with uh, three people in here, uh, the two workmen and the guy who sells bun cakes. And there's a nice Andy Moogle there if you lose, so... The letter, there's a little shop there as well which has got a nice item in it. And there is a treasure on the, there, just on the left hand side that I've opened but I didn't video. And this is the last of the waltzes, just show you the steals of him. So after that quick journey to Dali for that elixir, we can uh, go to Trano. Trano is one of my favourite places actually, and there's bound to be like a billion people to play cards with, so that's all good. It was also the start of the, um... oh, he plays cards as well, hang on a minute. Yeah, so I'm just gonna have a quick uh, game of cards with this guy and the next video will be Definitive Guide 10 for Final Fantasy 9. And um, that should be awesome.